Hi guys, Hi. come check out some behind the scenes. Hey. Okay. <laughs> work. Set and action. All right, we've got 18 minutes to move five more of these from the cargo bay down into here, or the oh. ship won't be balanced. Is everyone clear? Yeah. True that. Hi, I'm Mia Jack, and I play Sammy Saraway. I'm Ben Dawn, and I play Will Rivers. I'm Keitha Williams, and I play Martin. Hi, I'm Katie Gray Swan, and I play Doria Taylor. I'm Bryce Geyser, and I play Elliot Combs. Three, two, one, blast off! One of my favorite parts of working on the astronauts is the zero G. There isn't any gravity in space, so we get to do a lot of wire work. 20 odd feet in the air. Literally redefining hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome! Ah, ah, well, small ah. movements. That actually looks kind of cool. It's like having balloons under your arms and pretty much just like, yeah, slow motion. Yeah, it's kind of wobble. And for the wire work, we are using a stunt guy. His name is Sluggo. My name is Rob Boyce. Everyone calls me Sluggo, and I am the stunt coordinator on the astronauts. The show we're working on takes place in space, so it's zero gravity. Through many of the episodes, they're just hanging from the ceiling, and we're floating around, puppeteering them, getting to do what we need them to do. There's this scene where I was on wires. The set was spinning behind me. So like I couldn't see that it was spinning, but the camera was also spinning. So it creates this optical illusion that the camera is floating with yeah. me. I'm good. This is fun. The sets are all amazing. Really crazy to see. The first time I saw the sets, I was mind blown. Hey guys, I'm Dean Israelite, one of the executive producers and director of The Astronauts. We're here in Vancouver, Canada, where we have our stages. The guiding principle for us in designing the show was that everything needed to feel completely real. So when they get up into that rocket, Everything that you're seeing, all of the details, is what real astronauts in 15, 20 years are going to see and experience. Might as well check it out. Here we have the command module where our kids first enter. I was geeking out the first time I saw the command module because the seats, whenever you sit down on them, they go all the way back. The command module was difficult because we wanted to make it feel very realistic. And in order to do that, it has to be incredibly small. On a real spaceship, there wouldn't be excess space anywhere, but there certainly wouldn't be excess space in the command module. You gotta see this. Totally lux. Private bath and sheets are like the really good kind. Oh, and the smoothies. <sighs> this is totally top shelf, dude. You gotta check it out. These are the crew quarters. This set has two levels to it. So on the top level is where the kids hang out. This is where they'd make their food. This is where they'd play foosball. When you go down the steps, this is where they sleep. And we've made these bedrooms intentionally tiny. Because again, on a spaceship, space itself is at a premium. They are making you sleep in the sick bay? Making me? Are you nuts? It has this awesome space bed that reclines and has stirrups. Okay, sweetheart, that is an examination table. Yeah, I know, so cool. We are on set in the cargo bay. So in this scene, the weight on the ship is unsteady. It's making the whole ship wobble, but we have a way to fix it. There are three big garden terrariums. We're actually gonna shoot through these tubes and launch them through and get them to where they need to be. Super awesome. Fun working all together in those group scenes. It gives you the feel of actually being stuck on a spaceship all together. We all are so into our characters now that whenever we're in that group dynamic, it's kind of like a game of ping pong. It's like yeah. we, we're all going back and forth. Who was the guy that was dying to see this place? Come on. And now we can all stare at it together for 237 days. They're gonna turn us around. Guys, check out all the cool swag I made. So you're gonna trash the ship just like you do at home? Jeez, what bug caught up your butt? Fire in the galaxy. <laughs> Someone's popcorn is ready. It's about so much more than just the dialogue at this point, and I think that's really special. Makes it a lot more realistic and a lot more yeah. fun, fun to be a part of. Acting is reacting. That was cheesy, but I, I had to say it. I would snap, but I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching the behind the scenes. I gotta go back to set. Sorry. Thank you very much.